those two Americans stepped on the moon, the people of this world were brought closer together. That it is that spirit, the spirit of Apollo, that transcends geographical barriers and political differences. I only got uh, two autograph requests in today, but they are just uh, some absolutely amazing, amazing, amazing stuff. Uh, just uh, patience, persistence, and finding the right people to write to. Uh, so I'll start off with this one here. Um, this came from Harrisburg, Pennsylvania. This is what it says here. I'm not even sure if I even wrote to that address there. I don't remember doing that, but anyway, maybe it was forwarded. Um, but anyway, this is uh, Don Buchheister, or, uh, or more known as Bucky Buchheister, and he has signed his, uh, he was the general manager of the Cedar Rapids Reds. A uh, shout out to the old Stacy Schaefer Double S, I forget what his new, uh, new name is, and he signed it Bucky. It's in 1988. There it is. And then he signed the 1981 TCMA. Yeah, 1981 TCMA. Very tiny picture of him right there, signed Bucky. And he said, uh, Thanks for remembering me in the Cedar Rapids ballpark. I am retired now, but I still love baseball, Bucky. So that was really, really awesome to get. Before I get into the best one here, I purchased uh, some more cards off of eBay. And these came in pages, which is one of the reasons why I bought it. This is a Cornerstone 1995. I think it's 95, that's not important, 96. And this is Doctor Who Series 3, the complete set. So that's really awesome. None of these are going off for TTM. I can buy the, you know, single cards if I want to. Uh, so there's that, that's really cool. And then I've got some other cards towards the back here. It came with a promotional card, which usually sells for anywhere from one to five dollars, that orange one right there. Uh, that's from like series four, I think. And then I got um, a page of these, which are series two promotional cards. And that would cost me about five or six dollars to purchase that separately. Um, so essentially the set uh, cost me, and then the pages are essentially free, and the add-on cards I got were essentially free. And these are very difficult to find. The prism cards, I have one, two, three, and four. So I just need five and seven and I'll have all the seven doctors and these were like I don't know if they were one per box or what they were these are from 93 94 uh, 1994 1994 cornerstone so that was really awesome and the best one that you've probably been waiting for was the NASA success came from Marion Dyson and there's WWMDyson.com and you're like who's Marion J Dyson well, uh, Marion J. Dyson was, if I can find it here, is an author and a female NASA flight controller back in the 80s. And I had her sign. Where is that? Uh, well, anyway, before I have show her what she has signed, uh, here is a, a sheet about the books that she has written all about NASA. So she's an author. Uh, she sent me this little NASA decal, which is really cool. Uh, she sent me her business card, which is awesome, Marion J. Dyson. And she has sent me a letter saying, uh, Dear Mr. Strobel, I apologize for taking so long to respond. Uh, the letter came while I was on travel and then got misplaced. My husband and I were the first married couple in Mission Control on STS-4, so I got him to sign, too. I hope you will check out my book, A passion for space all about our shuttle days MD and so she gave me this decal and this is what you wanted to see this is STS 4 Mattingly Hartsfield and signed by Thor Dyson guidance officer 1981 to 1985 and Marianne Dyson FAO STS 4 and I forgot to, what FAO is for you can look that up this is from 1982 amazing NASA return a lot of my viewers will really enjoy that uh, she has a Wikipedia page so take a look at that as well hope you enjoyed that and thank you for watching